In this video, I'm going to show you one of the best defenses for defending bunch, U trips, really any formation. Uh, I think these are this is a really, really good defense for the meta that we're facing right now, and uh, we'll show you how to make it even better in this video. So four three even six one is the defense. If you want to find this, you can find it in New England. You can also find this in Kansas City. I recommend Kansas City or New England for this. And um, the setup that we're or the the play that we're going to be utilizing is the Sam Will Blitz. Now, what we want to do is make sure we have our auto alignment set to base align and our zone coverage set to match and then all we're going to do with this um, all we're going to do with this defense is we're just going to press and then from there what i like to do with this is really simple so we know that the tight end is really really good in this formation so what i like to do is man up my safety on the left side on this player you might need to move him down just a smidge just so that it kind of gives it doesn't give as much of a tell and then we're going to man up the left side guy on the running back now, what we're gonna also be able to do here with this is we're gonna drop a hard flat on the butt, on that tight end side. So we have a hard flat from that defensive end over there. So this is just a five man pressure. If they send five out, you're gonna get crazy good pressure off the right and you see how good this is because a lot of people, when they send five out, they're going to want to when people send five out in this year's game, they're trying to throw this quick wheel to the running back almost every single time. So this defense right here takes this away, and then now you're going to be able to lurk the tight end, which is the most important and powerful player in the U-Trips formation. Now, another reason why this defense is super, super effective is because you're going to get crazy, crazy disengages as well as crazy sheds. So let's say, for example, that they motion one of these guys across the formation, okay? Uh, I'll just show you here. All we're going to do is we're going to take that receiver or that um, that corner and we're going to man him up on him now. And now the tight end is covered, so we need to go guard the running back off the rip. So you see they send five out and the pressure is still able to get home. Now, if you want to learn how to run the whole 4-3, even 6-1 defense, make sure you join. Um, make sure that you join. Uh, my patreon page but this is a really really good defense for defending the current meta that we're facing with these different types of bunch and trips u trips type uh, formations now let's say the tight end runs across the formation so let's say they do something like this you're going to see right here the hard flat is going to help with that flat route and then we're going to be able to just lurk the tight end this is a really simple defense it's really 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 um effective uh for this so i don't know what my I don't know why my linebackers are being weird. I don't know if I audible or what. So let me get back out of there. We'll just throw the ball away. Uh, but I want to show you one thing. Else, one thing. Uh, one last thing with this. Now, the other thing that you can do with this defense is, again, let's say, um, you know, let's say that you know there's they're going to block their running back with this. What's really powerful is if you put edge threat on these outside guys, they're going to get one on ones. So if, in this situation where we're doing something like this adjustment right here, obviously I need to show blitz to get these guys to be in the proper spot. Um, but again, you're going to be able to lurk the tight end here. So again, boom, I'm lurking the tight end. Look at those edge threats go crazy. And you see how quickly we're going to be able to get sheds with this defense. What makes this defense, I think, super powerful is the sheds within it. So even if we wanted to go max coverage defense, for example, like this, um, you know, we're going to be in pretty good shape. And again, we're just helping poach the tight end. And if they want to stop that right side pressure, then they're going to have to start blocking their tight end, which nobody wants to do. And you see how powerful the edge threats are going to be on the outside. Now, obviously, you could run the same defense. Um, you could run the same defense with a zone variation. So if we wanted to play cover three, we could do something like this. So now we have cover three to that side. And then on this back side here, we're going to play kind of a cover two, a little bit more of a zone look. Um, and then again, I just want you to see here, you know, we're still only sending five. Um, and you'll see that we're able to jump these routes really quick. And we're kind of lurking in the middle of the field. So real simple defense, but really effective. When people see this defense, a lot of people panic. They don't know how to, they really don't know how to beat this defense consistently, especially people from what I've seen that run U trips and stuff. This is a really simple defense. And if they put that tight end on an out, you see that flat's going to jam it, and then we can kind of get over there and help it. By that time, they're getting sacked. So thanks for watching the video. If you want to get my full 4-3 even defensive ebook, make sure you join our Patreon. The link to sign up for the Patreon is in the description below. And uh, hope to see you guys over at the Patreon page.